Oh boy guys, welcome back. It's been a while. Sorry for the delay. Um, I have a an interesting here piece of meat here, a little piece of beef, a, a round eye, round roast, US choice. I I I I I like make messing around with this meat. I do. Um, I'm gonna try something that I don't know if people do or if it gets done. Um, I'm gonna try to put it in through the spigot and let it cook in the rotisserie <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna season it up and honestly I don't know what's gonna happen uh, I don't again I don't know if this happens or if this is done it, it's just an idea that comes into my head and I'm just gonna go with it okay so I went ahead and seasoned up real good I used salt pepper and I used uh, garlic powder uh, it's, it's probably like my three favorite things that I uh, that I like to add here. You can tell that I use pepper a lot. I always use a lot of pepper because I'm always sniffling. And um, it's always the pepper that gets me. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna string this up and then I'm gonna let it sit for a while because I want the I want it to like hang out and um, you know kind of marinate a little while and uh, we'll get back to you. Alright so I'm since I'm kind of a bit of a science nerd uh, test kitchen is to me when it comes to food uh, the closest thing to <laughs> scientists working with food right uh, that have a, have a channel and stuff. And they, they swear by going ahead and trying to make it as even as possible. So they string it up, they string the meat up and it makes sense to me, at least that their explanation that, um, if you string it up and you keep it nice and like hot, that, that, that one sucked. But if you get them, <laughs> if you get them nice and like, you know, I'm struggling, but that's fine. Uh, I, I guess I'll just maybe cut that and redo it. But, uh, if you just get them to be nice and uh, kind of evenish, it should cook way better. And at least that's the theory. Uh, the problem is I might just do a bow tie here. Is that, does that work here? Is that gonna be okay? Yeah, there you go. Okay, so maybe a bow tie is okay on that one. And I, may, I mean, I have enough to go tighter. I actually always give myself extra because I never know how much I need so uh, okay I'm gonna tighten this one and go to bow tie because it seems like it worked just fine before okay two out of two ain't bad that, that's <laughs> where we got ourselves a, a pattern of success and since this one didn't work out 100% we can go ahead and flip this guy get it tighter let's see if we can hold the rest of the stuff yeah look at that and actually, I'm not going to go with a bow tie here because I don't have enough. Especially when your hands start getting all, like, mushy and stuff. Ah! Okay. So, there you go. So, I got it as round as possible. And now, I'm going to let her sit. And before we, uh, we get too crazy, just let her sit there for a little bit. And marinate. Okay. So, the meat has been sitting for, like, about two hours now. And it's basically nice and, uh... I don't know what it's called, but it's stringy. But um, I, I just poked it in, and I'm just curious. This is this. I'm literally just doing this. I'm not searing it like the video said for the um, the test kitchen, because I want to see if the caloric will just cook this evenly and just right by just rotisserieing it. So we're gonna get it into the rotisserie like right now. Okay, so we need to put it in this way. and there it is all right we're gonna put it into the air fry mode we're gonna put it in the air fry mode and it only spins in chicken mode and it gives me like a 40 minute uh, rotisserie time so I'm actually gonna test out if it works with the 40 minute 435 I'm literally just gonna see what this does I don't care if this fails because I can always recook it more if I have to, or I can always do more or less, you know what I'm saying? Well, not less, it can't take back time, but I can always, you know, eat it well done, whatever. But if it comes out just fine, this might be really, a really interesting way of cooking. Okay guys, I put it in for the 40 and it's been only nine minutes and it's looking nice, nice and brown already. 
Okay, so I just stopped it real quick. Um, you guys actually gave me this advice. A few of you gave me the advice to use a thermometer. So I'm actually going to pop this guy in here. And I'm hoping to see how high it goes. It says medium rare for beef. And pork is 145. Um, it's not even touching. <laughs> it's not even touching that. So we're actually going to go in and... Um, yeah, we're going to... We're gonna keep it in for the 20 minutes that it's got, but I'm actually gonna lower the temperature. I'm gonna lower the temperature because I really don't want it to keep burning it from the outside, but I want it to reach that one, what is it, 145 internally. So let's we'll go with 300 for the rest of the 20 minutes and hope for the best. That's, that's what you gotta do with the caloric. You just literally have to cope for the best because this is just literally me on a whim. I'm just trying stuff out. Okay guys, it's completely shut off right now. And I am going to take an internal look at its temperature. Uh, hopefully it'll touch the 145, because I like it medium rare. Uh, <laughs> I'm always laughing, sorry guys. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. This is exciting. Oh, yeah. It's a little higher than medium rare, but that's perfect. Uh oh, 50. Uh oh, it's reaching medium. <laughs> I almost don't want to show you guys how far it goes. Okay, it goes 150. Okay, so it's between a little above medium rare, but that's pretty good. I'm actually just going to let it rest here for a little bit. I'm not even going to like move it. I'm just going to let it hang out for a little while. And oh, oh. Oh, oh no, look at all that. All that goodness is coming out. I'm sorry, baby. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> all right, guys, it's been a little bit over 10 minutes and there it is. This guy looks cooked all the way around. Looks nice. It looks really nice. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and cut these strings real quick without cutting myself because, yeah, I don't need that. So here's a better look at it. Look at that meat. <laughs> that meat looks really, like, well cooked on the outside. Looks, <laughs> looks really good. Okay, so I'm going to cut into her. Um, again, always thank your... Thank the cow that gave its life for this. And I'm gonna cut back here. Where it's kind of thick. You guys can see. Okay, wow, yeah. So there you go. This is the fatty part right here. And it's a little pink, which is nice. I've got the little hole right here where it passed through. And this is definitely a little bit over medium rare, which is um, which is fine. It's 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 not gonna bother me. I'll eat it just the same. Um, but if you guys like medium rare, uh, probably maybe go 15 minutes. Yeah, 15 minutes um, after the the initial, you know, searing, self searing. Um, it's got some pink. I don't, know if I, I don't know if you guys can see. It, it doesn't look as pink in real IRL <laughs> with my regular eyes. But for some reason when I look at the camera, it looks like it's like super red. So I don't know if it's like the red from here, you know, kind of popping out more. But um, it's got some color. It's got some color. Now, let me cut this guy in half. Oh, just like that. Let me cut this little piece right here. Cut that guy in half because... <laughs> whatever <laughs> all right and now i'm gonna try this guy right here because i'm, I'm really hungry mm. Mhm. Mm yeah that tastes really soft i'm not getting much of the season because it's all on top but that tastes really good it tastes really juicy okay and i mean it's gone it's not like I didn't do anything special to it. I didn't put like MSG, what is it? <laughs> MSG or whatever. But I, you know, it's just regular seasoning and not sure. It just kind of like crumbles. 
it doesn't have like a lot of give which is also really nice damn that's really good mm. this part right here is like the like the well really well seasoned part and yeah yeah mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah that came out really good mm. yeah <laughs> listen i just i was just messing around listen i i don't i don't know if you guys are into that or like no you don't you're not supposed to do i don't I don't know what the proper procedure is to making meat, but obviously for for the most part, people just want to make sure that the food is cooked well, right? Now if it's cooked well, if it tastes good, who cares how it's made, right? <laughs> and I'm laughing, okay? I'm laughing because um, I like when something is successful, and I feel like this. I, I, I'm really enjoying this rotisserie feature on the caloric. Because I, I'm almost thinking about getting make, maybe like a shish kebab or something like that. <laughs> I'm skewer the you know some meat and some veggies and stuff and we just cook it real quick. Mmm, wow, very really good. Hey, right, this came out really really good. Like it's really like tender and soft and it's like breaking in my mouth. <laughs> it's like falling apart, you know. There's not like the gamey chunks of fat or anything like that or like i don't know if it's overcooked or undercooked i don't know what it makes it you know stay in your mouth kind of like hard or whatever but man uh-huh look at that yeah let me let me see if i can break it up a little bit yeah look at that whoop my bad so like that kind of peels a little bit oh yeah <laughs> i'm sorry i keep laughing it's just it, it, I'm just happy when something turns out well. Mmm. Yum. Me. Mmm. <laughs> Holy moly. <laughs> I share I share with my animals, right? You guys have seen all my videos. I share with my animals. Mm-hmm. And they're going to love this. This tastes... Oh, this, is, this is almost so good that I don't want to share with them. <laughs> oh, really good. I'm about to eat all of this by myself. <laughs> hey guys, thank you so much. I appreciate you guys coming by, checking out the channel. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Share with your friends. I'll see you guys on the next one. Hey girls. <laughs> I wonder what you guys want. Oh, easy, easy, easy. Uh, 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 no, no, sit down. Oh, sit, wait. Good girl, he's a piece. There you go. No, no, share. There you go. There you go. See, <laughs> I don't even know why I even feed the dogs anything because they don't even know that they just ate something delicious. They just swallow it. <laughs> like they don't even care. Look at them. You got more for me? <laughs> now these two are totally different. These are some big morsels. Here you go. I'll give you one and I'll give you one. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> wow. Yeah, this is for you. Oh, she swallowed it. <laughs> Wait, what is this? You done? Oh, wow, she's done. All right, well, I'm getting a phone call, so yeah. They'll enjoy it. I know they will. Bye, guys.